Hi, this is Shelley Kraft. We're coming to you live on SNN Live. We're at the LD Micro Invitational in Bel Air, California at the Lux Hotel. I am with Dr. Eugene Seymour of NanoVericides, symbol NNVC. It's a publicly traded company. Welcome back Thank to you. SNN Live. It's been a while. It's been a number of years, uh, Shelley. It's good to see you again. Ladies and gentlemen, I think one of my very first interviews in the history of SNN Live was with Dr. Seymour, and I want to thank you for that. My pleasure. So let's get an update on the company. Okay. An overview. An overview. Well, um, we've been in business now for eight years. We've just recently, a week ago, moved to the NYSE MKT. We're trading um, extremely well, market cap of about $270 million. We have 10 drugs that we developed against 10 different viruses and this is a platform we have so we can make a drug very quickly uh, we made one for the British government in the space of five days against this new virus that's uh, circulating in the Middle East so we have Which an no one probably has heard about except oh, if you're in the middle of no, it no actually um, there's been an article in the New York Times mm -hmm. and it's uh, been killing a lot of people. They were trying to decide, was it a camel that was carrying it? Was it a bat? So anyway, and then the uh, British government asked us to uh, work on this because they've had a whole series of cases of people who traveled from the Middle East uh, to the UK. So we are building a plant to manufacture the drug for human trials. We're doing toxicology studies. We're preparing to go into our human trials for, for our drug for influenza and my own feeling Shelley and I, well, this has to be uh, verified with the human trials is that one dose of this drug in hospitalized people may in fact eradicate the symptoms of the flu very quickly is your lawyer gonna let you say no, that I don't think he can but I said I think <laughs> That may be, and possibly, but we we have to wait until we do our human trials next year. But I'm very um, optimistic that it's going to work that way. Even following that, we have an oral version of the same drug. We have a drug for dengue hemorrhagic fever, which, by the way, the FDA just uh, awarded us orphan drug designation. Big deal. Big and uh, then we have a drug for herpes of the eye, herpes of the genitals. We have a great drug for HIV, which we reported on last month. And to a number of people, it all sounds too good to be true. Sounds like I'm a snake oil salesman. To the rest of the people, they understand that they've looked into the future of medicine. Well, let me stop you for a minute because, you know, this is a very short interview, which you're saying a lot of things. And for, you're a publicly traded company. Correct. So let me stop you and ask you to please give the website so that anyone who's watching this video at this moment can also go right to the website okay. and look at the company. Fine. The website is www.nanoviricides, N-A-N-O, V-I-R-I-C-I-D-E-S dot com. We're updating the website. I, we're just doing the final approvals. It'll look much nicer than it does now, but it has a lot of important information about how all this works and uh, what we're doing to impact the future of the uh, treatment of viral diseases. Now, that, I hate to say it, is a growth area in the market. Really now, I'd say so. And as we continue to disturb the um, habitats of these various animals, bats and, and other um, what's known as zoonosis type of diseases, you're gonna see more and more viral uh, diseases. There's dengue, there's dengue? No one's heard of dengue. There are 400 million cases of dengue in the world. Um, What's that, the new malaria? Uh, it's worse than malaria. And uh, there's dengue, uh, there's Hanta, there's West Nile, there's hepatitis C. I mean, I, the list is, is infinite, so we'll never, ever run out of targets. And the amazing thing is using our platform, we're able to create these drugs super double quick. And do I have time to explain how they work? I think if you can make it quick, why not? Okay, here we go. All our drugs consist of two parts. A nanomicelle, 
20 billionths of a meter in size, it does the destruction. Attached to it is a mimic of what's found on the surface of the target cell of the virus. Every virus needs a target cell. So when the virus sees our drug, it thinks that it's landed on its target cell and we open up, much like a vi um, Venus flytrap, and destroy the uh, virus, it's the end of the game. It's absolutely unbelievable, but in almost 6,000 animals we've quite well proven the, uh, the case. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get that website one more time. Okay, www.nano, N-A-N-O, Virucides, V is in Victor, I-R, I-C-I-D-E-S dot com. Ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Eugene Seymour, who looks, you don't look a day older than the day I met you. And he's from NanoVericides, publicly traded company, N-N-V-C on the N-Y-S-E these days, correct? N-Y-S-E M-K-T. Love it. Ladies and gentlemen. Shelly, thanks very much. You're quite welcome. I'm Shelly Kraft. This is SNN Live. We're at the LD Micro Invitational in Bel Air, California at the Lux Hotel. Thanks again. Thank you.